What's up YouTube? It's Toron bringing you a brand new Feed the Beast Let's Play. Um, I would have been doing this a lot sooner but I needed to build a new PC in order to handle Feed the Beast and recording and everything else and so here I am. Got a brand new PC. I'll give you guys the specs momentarily um, but we're starting off a Feed the Beast world. Um, we got a silverwood tree here and we got a village right near where we spawn. Um, I'm playing on the Ultimate Mod Pack. Um, it's the one that caught my fancy the most. I wanted to try Miscraft and a few other things. Um, so that's what we have here. Uh, this PC that I'm running now has 32 gigs of memory. It's running a GeForce G uh, TX 680. It has a 250 gigabyte solid state drive for the OS. And then it has a 1 terabyte drive for recording to as well as a one terabyte drive for just regular data storage um, and yeah it should be pretty awesome I think I've actually been testing recording all day today with just different different programs and different things and I haven't had any problems that I can see yet so I'm, I'm excited for this series because I've been wanting to do a Feed the Beast Let's Play I just haven't been able to do so because of my um, my computer, my laptop just wasn't able to handle it. And so now I'm pretty sure we should be able to get a, to record this and everything else that we want to record without too many problems. Um, what I'm going to do here first though is we're going to make ourselves a tool. Uh, rats. I need some more of these. We're going to make ourselves an axe. And then we're going to make ourselves a pickaxe in a moment. That way we can go get us some supplies. And pick that back up. And get us some more wood. Um, but yeah, I'm, I'm really excited. Um, it's been a while since I've recorded anything. Uh, last November I ended up in the hospital for some health problems. And with my computer giving me issues, I just haven't been able to record at all. Um, but luckily, things have gotten better. I'm doing a lot better health-wise. And I have a new PC, so recording should happen more frequently now. Um, I'm going to get back into my other series as well. I haven't forgotten about that one. I just need to copy the world over to this computer still and get that all ready to go. Um, but I've been really excited to try Feed the Beast. I've been watching... Um, you know, looking at it on a diff online, checking out the different mods and what's available on them, and I'm really excited to, to just mess with it. And I'm happy, to, I'm excited to be able to share it with you guys as well. Um, so I'm looking forward to this. Uh, what I'm doing right now, though, is I'm going to get some supplies together, and then I'm going to barricade the villagers into their homes so that the evil hordes of zombies, when they come later, don't kill my friends. Because villagers are important. Yes, go in your house. Thank you. Oh, my only other the other other problem we run into is that if there's no light in their house, they can spawn indoors. Oh look, glowstone. Very nice. Let's see here. 25 chicken nuggets, huh? For an emerald? You're crazy, man. Crazy. You. Oh, hey. I like this guy. We gotta keep him alive. Oh, nice. Let's check it out. We have lots of mushrooms biome. Very nice. And we have a savanna biome. Sweet. So, we need to get some... I need some cobble actually and we need to get some food here soon so let's hope this grows ah there we go we need some cobble and I need blah alright fine I'll just pick up some of this I'm gonna make a furnace so I can make some charcoal real quick because I didn't see any coal hanging around there 
because we all know the baddies are going to come out. Actually, I need to fix my sound here real quick. Turn that up. And we'll turn that up. And I'm still not hearing it. Uh, let's try this again. We'll try 30. There we go. I'm still not hearing it, but hopefully when I play back it's loud enough. Otherwise I'll just have to adjust it again later. 16. I want to make a couple tools. There we go. And if I can jump out of there, bad guys can jump out of there too. So, there, that'll keep the baddies from coming up for now. Alright, so, we need to drop the crafting table, and let's make ourselves a furnace. I think what I'm going to do is make my initial home here in the, in the village. Um, that way... we can have a nice you know good starting area we got the villages around here we already have crops to pick from um i think it'll be a good a good starting place we have a silver tree that way i have no idea what's this way yet um we got plenty of mountain there we have that way to go explore i think this is going to be a good place to start all right give me some more Um, seven, eight, give me eight, all right. We'll use this to make some torches, we'll light up the villagers area here, and then when they go in for the night to retire, then we'll lock up, we'll uh, lock them in, so they can't get away. Yeah, we should have plenty of food with uh, all these... Yeah, wheat, potatoes, yeah, this would be good. Good, good, good. And, of course, we got cows aplenty around us, so... Oh, hey, look! There's another silver wood tree over that way. And another one there. Oh, looks like we've got snow over there, too. Woot! I'm excited. Why you no fix? Alright, looks like we've got a funky spot there. Anyways... What do you got for me? No, f uh, I'm gonna give you a what you want. Paper for an emerald. Hmm, you might be worth something later. No. Where's the sun? Nope. Wow, you definitely aren't worth what you're asking. All right, nothing down there to come out. All right, good, good, good. Let's check on my coal. Sweet. Go here. Oh, yeah. First, I need these. And then that. And then this. There we go. I'm going to need some food soon. That one, and that one. Now there was a fail click. Alright, and we have enough seeds so we can replant. Ah, too soon. Oh, there's some more over there though. Alright. That should be able to hold us for a bit. At least till we can start cooking some potatoes. Potatoes is where it's at. Ah, oh, if I'd gotten one more, I could have had... Ah, uh, four will do. Alright. So let's start lighting up around here, just to help... Keep these guys safe. Alright. 
yeah, I'm, I'm looking forward uh, to trying out Mistcraft and Thomcraft and all the other crafts out there. I know there's a lot of things in Feed the Beast to, to get excited about, and I'm just barely scratching the surface with everything that I've been reading up on. So I'm, I'm excited. I'm hoping that... This does well. And I think I put too many of these here. I did. Oh, it's getting nighttime. I will protect you, I promise, villagers. Come on, homeboy. Let's go get in your homes. Alright, you're safe. Ha! Ah, just to keep you guys safe. And let's light up the area a bit. Let's see. Any guys in here? No. But we still want to light this up to keep things from spawning. Alright. Ah, oh, that's what I should have made me myself as a sword. Oh, no time like the present. Alright, and nope, I want that one. Ah, I keep doing that. And we have enough cobblestone. Woo! Now we can defend ourselves. Hopefully. Alright. Those have torches near them. So far, no baddies. And this will keep the villagers safe at least. Oh! We have villagers in there. All right. And oh, we have villagers in there too. Hey, we can't let you get hurt. I want your map. Oh, it's a cow. You're in my house, dude. I need to have one of these for me. Sorry, Mr. Cow. Oh, he's armored. Die already! Thank you. Sorry, Mr. Cow. I need your meat. Alright. Hey, look. There's reeds over there. Woot! That'll save me having to look for some tomorrow. I can get those, plant them. Die. Thank you. Oh, an angry zombie. Oh, run away. This could be bad. This could be very bad for my health. Haha, -ha, suckers. Let's see, you gave me now. Alright. Um, I'm gonna wait for the day to come. And then I'm gonna come back to you guys when we're ready to go exploring some caves beneath us. Because we're gonna need resources. Everything in Feed the Beast needs resources, and we have, like, none. So, um, give me just a few minutes, and I will be right back with you guys. Alright, and I'm back. So, as you can see, I've done a little bit. I got the tools ready. Um, I got us, uh, I've managed to get us eight arrows. I got us fresh stone tools. I got a, I got our stone sword. Um, got a few more resources here. 
I got a bed now, and I've slept in it. I just barely made it the next day. And we're going to go down into that. We're going to go over here. Actually, I fell over here into a cave, and I think that's the one we're going to go explore for now. Is this cave right here? This is where we're going. All right. And as you can see, I came down here for a second just to kind of light it up to see if it went anywhere. And it does. So let's gather a few resources here. Because we're going to want the coal. Always need coal. At least until we get some powered machines, then we won't need the coal as much. But until then, it's going to be handy. Because I need more torches eventually. And we'll need to power some machines initially to get stuff going. Alright. And plus we have marble here, which is kind of handy. And iron. Iron is what we want. And copper. Iron and copper will be very handy to have. Um, but yeah, I'm not going to bore you guys with like this crazy long uh, gathering session. I'm just kind of showing you guys where I'm at. And what I'll do is I'll, I'll do some caving, gather the resources. And uh, But what I will show you guys is the process of building some of these machines. Uh, getting things ready for to, you know, kind of start the whole machine. Basically, I'll share with you guys my learning experience as I learn the different machines I can make and such. Oh, looky, looky, looky. More iron. And from what I can tell, iron is very valuable. So it's good to have. What is this one? What is that? Oh, hey. I'll need the earth shards for um, Thomcraft. That'll be handy. Uh, what I do want to do is get a quarry as soon as I can, so that way I don't have to manually do this anymore. Uh, we can have the quarry run itself and gather for us. But what I'm going to have to do is get the resources to build a quarry, and I'm not quite sure what that's going to take just yet. But I know it's going to take some copper. Alright. Yeah, I'm not going to make this first video very long either. I'm going to kind of keep it at a good... Uh, um, kind of keep it to a good length. Uh, not too crazy. Uh, just so that way you guys can at least you know see an updated video. And then I will start putting up more videos uh, th th basically on a regular basis from now on since I've been able to get my new computer together, like I said previously. So I'm excited. I get to make me some iron tools here soon, uh, which would be nice. Instead of these uh, stone tools, which, you know, nobody can complain about stone. It does the job. What's this green one? It doesn't want to break. Um, I better not try to break something if it's not going to break. Yep, I'll come back for those. What's this block? Hopefully it's useful. Let's see. Aluminum ore, tin ore. I'm not sure which one that is I just picked up. Alright, hopefully we don't run into any baddies down here. Uh, but we'll see. So, but I'll tell you what guys, I'm actually going to go through and cave a little bit. And then once I've done a little bit of caving, I'll come back and show you guys what the spoils are uh, right before in the episode. So I'll be back with you guys soon. And we're back. Um, I'm going to show you guys the spoils of caving. We got diamonds, plenty of iron for now, some, some coal to work with. Um, overall, it was a nice, good haul. Um, 
I found an awesome villager when I was looking at my villagers that I have available. I want to show you guys. He offers wheat. He has like wheat for emeralds. So that's pretty nice. Um, we can get ourselves some emeralds there from the wheat that's available. I also planted myself some sugar cane, I think this is. Right? Yeah, sugar canes. And I also, um, as soon as I'm able to start getting some diamond or some emeralds, which I just gotta harvest the wheat, um, I wanna start working on this craft stuff. And this guy has. Um, he has the another one of those maps that I can buy from him. So I want to buy the map, and I want to start going to those worlds. Haha, ha, you guys can't get out. I'm keeping you safe. And I also want to start building a wall around this village, but I want to do it out of the basalt. So I want to build a dark wall around the village, but i got to go and find the basalt. And I have no idea which direction to go, so I might just pick a direction that is all water that way, so I'll probably go that way. Um, but I'm going to go exploring off camera and see what I can find. If anything eventful happens, I'll share it with you guys, but um, I think I'm going to end the video here. The thing I'm going to do next time for sure, though, is I'm going to build myself a pulverizer, a macerator, and a couple machines. And we're going to get going with the uh, maceration and pulverizing of of ores and stuff so we can get the most out of what we find. Um, but I'm excited. Uh, it's turning out pretty good so far. I was really happy with the haul. There's even more ores that I didn't get down below because my inventory was full. Uh, so I'm going to have to go back again at some point and finish uh, getting what's beneath this area. And then we're going to, I'm going to build a turtle, I think. And the turtle is, we're going to use the turtle to excavate until I can get enough materials for a uh, mining laser. I don't mind laser, but a, uh, a quarry. So that's kind of where we're at right now. Um, but I wanted to just give you guys a quick update before I go ahead and end the episode today. Um, but thanks everybody for watching. I'm glad to be back. I hope everybody uh, sticks around for what's to come. And take care everybody. Peace.